Hey guys and welcome to Smart Home Things, a channel dedicated to smart home automation. Today we will be flashing Tasmota firmware into Shelly One Wi-Fi Relay. To do that we will need a couple of things. We will need a programmer, some wires and a breadboard. We can use a second person instead of a breadboard, but you should buy a breadboard anyway. So all those things can be bought cheap on sites like AliExpress or basically any other electronics store. Okay, so remember to subscribe because all of this what we are doing today will be used in the future video uh, where we will be converting a simple lamp to a smart lamp that can be controlled via Apple Home app and a regular switch. So remember about that subscribe button and like if you like the video. So let's get on with this. So as I said in the uh, beginning of the video, uh, we will need uh, some kind of a programmer. I have basically the cheapest one from AliExpress, URT, TTL, RS232 or whatever. You will also need some cables. Uh, those cables came with, with the programmer itself, so quite handy. If you don't have that, you can buy them really cheap on AliExpress. Then we'll be using uh, Shelly 1. So uh, the schematic for Shelly 1 is, this, is displayed currently on the screen. So all the connections I will be making uh, are displayed currently uh, on the top right side uh, of the uh, video. Uh, now we are starting with the connection process. Uh, first uh, I'm connecting ground uh, to, to the breadboard because we will have to bridge ground to GPIO port of the Shelly. So I'm connecting ground to ground as it's displayed uh, in the schematic. Secondly, I'm connecting the second cable uh, to the same lane of the breadboard. Uh, next, I take the second cable and bridge the ground to the GPIO zero port of the uh, Shelly. And now uh, it's time for the VCC, so the 3.3 volts from the programmer to the third socket in, in the Shelly. And next we have the RX and TX uh, connections. So basically RX from the programmer goes to TX uh, of the Shelly and TX from uh, the programmer goes to Rx in the Shelly. And basically that's it for connecting uh, wires from your programmer uh, to, to, to Shelly. Now uh, it's time for the software part. Uh, for me, Visual Studio Code is basically the best uh, software to do uh, things. Uh, I'm using the Platformio uh, plugin. In this Platformio plugin in Platformio.ini, you have to specify the port that your uh, programmer is connected. Depending from your uh, machine PC or Mac, uh, it will differ quite uh, much. But basically, uh, do some edits in my user config.h file. You can specify your uh, Wi Fi there, so you don't have to configure that uh, from the beginning. Uh, select the version you want to run by uncommenting uh, the, uh, the one you want to use and then basically uh, press upload and you will see a progress bar and your programmer will start flashing like crazy and after a minute or so you will see a success uh, prompt so after that you can disconnect your programmer and basically you are good to go. And now I'm just connecting the programmer to the USB port, of course, uh, always wrong way around. And now just pressing upload and the upload process is started. As you can see, the programmer is flashing and after a minute, uh, everything will be done and uh, we can disconnect the programmer and uh, the flashing process is complete. Okay, so this is it for today. Thank you for watching and please remember to like, share and subscribe because 
Seeing this channel grow really keeps me motivated. See you in the next one. Bye.